So to get past my pretty little clothesline here, uh, this whole area, kind of pan back a little bit, I'll give you a little taste of all that, the quiet chickens. That whole area is the main garden, and uh, that will all be broken up, should be broken up by the end of next week. So, uh, this has all been hit with um, last year's chicken poop and all that good uh, fertilizer. It's free, so I might as well get it, you know. Um, and fortunately, the growth on top of it hasn't been too bad as far as weeds and all that. A lot of this is, isn't, uh, actually a lot of these are offshoots of other plants too. Uh, that just, you know, they'll have to be ground up into the mix. But, uh, yeah, I'm excited for it. Uh, in the comments, kind of let me know what all you're getting going if you're doing a regular garden or if you're doing like me and doing multiple things like uh, I do a couple of gardens plus uh, have a bunch of giant old feeder pots that I use. Uh, for, I don't know what they're called. Buckets. Gigantic buckets, okay? <laughs> I got them for free. Uh, I use those you know, to grow stuff closer to the house, so that way it's kind of in my zone one area I know that I'll take care of, no matter what, no matter how bad the weather is or how late for work I am, it doesn't matter. You see them, you can take care of them, and you can pick from them, so you don't lose out on anything. But, uh, or are you starting out in your first little pots? It's a pretty exciting time, so anyways, give a shout out, let me know what you're doing and getting into, and we'll try to cover it this year.